there's been so much talk in the papers now, the reintroduction of travel bans, kind of countries now imposing mask wearing, you know, mandatory vaccines, all of this thing. Like the variant thing, I have only lately come to this party that there's going to be loads of these. It's not just one. We're going to run out of letters before we run out of variants. And I don't even know many letters are in the Greek alphabet. I just find myself in an abeyance, just waiting to see, sitting back, waiting for the science and feeling maybe, am I being too complacent about it? I don't think you are at all. I I think, uh, I know this is a story because as you've rightly said that they're bringing in travel restrictions all around Europe or becoming fortress Europe again about COVID and people are worried. The last major variant we saw was Delta and we're still dealing with the wave that that that, that has, I suppose, had and inflicted upon us. But what we don't know, I think it's important to, to highlight what we don't know this morning for people. We don't know if this is more transmissible. We don't know that this is more severe and we don't know that it's not going to respond to vaccines. So at the moment, Moment. All we know is is that it is slightly different in shape as 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 a virus to what we are currently dealing with. Um, I I do think we need to stay calm. I think it's a real kind of keep calm and carry on situation. We have enough to be worrying about dealing with what we have going yeah. on, which is the Delta wave that we're living with, without catastrophizing what may never happen. Obviously, we have to keep an eye on this variant. Obviously, we have to be ready to react to it if it is a problem. But at the moment, we don't even know that it is a problem. And there's only so many things people can worry about at once. It is because there's only, I mean, in the grand scheme of things, a handful of these cases around the world. And they are still studying it. And we're told that even if it is all of the bad things we're told, and it is the worst one ever, there will be a vaccine within 100 days made. Anyway, listen, let me know what you think. Am I being too complacent? Uh, or are we catastrophizing? too much about it. Is there a degree of panic setting in and are we just going to keep riding this roller coaster?